Hi all and uh, welcome back to a small help video. Today we are going to talk about charging issues and having slow charging progress on your iPad or iPhone. So here I have some tips and tricks how to solve your problem. First of all, there is the hardware part of the charging and there we of course have to look at the different cables that you use for charging. For example, I have a charging cable right here. And as you can maybe see, it is actually broken. I'm able to see the wires inside the cable and that's not really how it is supposed to look like. So make sure to check your cables that there are no debris, no uh, cuts or anything. For example, I have another one right here and that cable is totally intact and is working as expected. It is actually fresh out of the box from the store. So make sure to uh, check your cables once in a while and especially if you see charging issues, make sure your cables are all right and is fully working. Maybe try the cables on another device and see if it is the same problem and then maybe try and borrow a cable from somebody else and try to charge your device with the new cable. Another part is of course the charger. And here I have two different chargers. One is for the iPad, another one is for the iPhone. And those are of course not giving the same output for your device. I even have a old iPad charger right here and that one is still working, but it is actually only supposed to be used for old iPad devices. I know that a lot of users use those for the new ones, but my recommendation is to use the correct charger that came with your device. I know sometimes they break down and then you have another one in your home and then you just simply use the ones you have. But I actually recommend using the correct charger that came with your device. And of course the charger can be broken. So if you, for some reason, have a suspicion that it is not used, uh, working as expected, well, then uh, try and borrow a new charger, the same kind of charger that is the correct one for your device and see if that is working. So make sure your hardware is in place and is working as expected. Another thing is, of course, to make sure that your device is up to date on the iOS version. So go into settings, go into general, and up here at the top, you have the software update. And in here, you will be able to see if you are on the latest version. And as you can actually see here for my device here is that I am actually not on the latest version. So that is definitely something that I need to do. Make sure your device is up to the latest version and is fully functioning because that could also be a issue that it is not running the latest version. Apple always try to create new things on their devices and also, of course, fix a lot of bugs, uh, bugs uh, on the software and that could actually also be an issue for slow charging. Another thing you can have a look at is, of course, also try to make sure that all apps are closed down, so no open apps, and then go into settings again. And you have a airplane mode functionality in here. So when trying to charge, simply put your iPad or iPhone in airplane mode and then start charging again. That can actually cause uh, faster charging and uh, that will make your problem go away. I know it is not always this case, but sometimes airplane mode can actually speed up your charging time. Next thing you can also have a look at is of course to look at your charging port. So let me try and find my charging port on this device. So I will put it up here and at the end I have a charging port right here. Sometimes that can actually be full of dust and dirt and all kinds of stuff from your carrying it around in your 
home so uh, let's clean it out i have a toothbrush right here so uh, try to take your toothbrush start cleaning it like this and i can actually see dust coming out of my charging port so that is definitely something that it could be a issue for my charging port you can also take a wooden stick and try to put it in here and see if you are able to take out dust or dirt from your device. So make sure to clean your charging port. That is actually a common issue for a lot of iPhones because a lot of users actually have their iPhones in their pocket. And in your pockets, there will definitely be dirt and dust. So that is a common issue for charging issues. So make sure to uh, clean out your charging port. I think that was actually all I had for you today. I hope you got some good tips and tricks how to solve your slow charging problem. If you have any questions or comments, put it in the section beneath. And if you like my video, give me a thumbs up. And I really appreciate if you also subscribe to my channel. I hope you will have a good day and I will talk to you soon.